All right, in this video, basically answering the question, can you load your Suron or Segway bike on a truck, on a bike carrier? And the answer is yes. You want to remove the battery. The battery itself is about 35 pounds. So you take that out, the bike will be about 80 to 85 pounds. And this, what I have back here, is a Swagman. So connecting to your hitch as normal. These are swing down arms. And to me, it's a perfect fit. And if you think about it, I have the tire in the back. Now, nothing's touching, right? But look, look how sturdy this is. I'm shaking that. Let's see. So that ain't going anywhere. I actually had an extension on this same bar on that Land Cruiser down there because the hitch is further recessed. The tire seems to be further out. And I actually like this better, not using an extension. So that's that Swagman I bought used on Craigslist. I found it for 60 bucks, and I think new, maybe they're 160, but the guy was close enough. I went and picked it up, and that'll do the job. And I just put the bike, you can actually put two bikes here, but obviously you see this other uh, inset for tires tire care or tire basket if you will uh, obviously i'm not fitting anything with that rear tire in the way but that style works you know you don't have to go spend uh 800 to 1200 bucks on a tooly or some fancy deal this works fine and it's rated for 160 pounds right now it's got about 80 pounds on there technically you could put two bikes but i think you're pushing the limits but you could Maybe I would add some bungee cords and attach it in an extra way. And uh, what I liked, what worked out perfect, if you've got the Segway, I pop, I pop this down. So let's see if I can get that up. So if you can see right here, this, this um, hook just click, click, click goes down and uh, ratchets down and it's nice and tight sits right on the metal frame you don't want to put it on the plastic you want to put it on the metal part like this part so you know you're going to play around with moving your wheel trays back and forth to get the perfect fit but um it's great and if you look here if i can get this on camera um, it's not going to damage the frame because there's enough space right here even if the bike rocks the whole piece rocks that's me really pushing it here so and then my uh, foot peg actually touches my tire, so it's just an extra spot of security. So there you have it. It's a two inch hitch, works great. And then obviously take the battery off. They're pretty quick to put in and out, as you know. So yeah, Segway X260, 160, or in this case, a Suron love that bike that thing is so much fun um there it is on that hitch so get go get yourself one you don't have to break the bank just get one of these swagmans i think there might be some other brands like they rebrand it under a different name and then uh, this is a wrap so i might post another video on how to wrap pretty easy i have to finish it though i might just wrap this this and then maybe the cover we'll see but there you have it, Suron sitting back of a Land Cruiser 80 series. All right, subscribe to the channel if you like Land Cruisers, biking. I got a Turbo Levo Specialized, like to go biking on that. Basically everything to get to the outdoors and anywhere this Land Cruiser can't go, which is not much, can pretty much go everywhere. Well, this bike can go through some of the tight trails uh, up in the wilderness. All right, thanks for watching.